Happy New Year. And the Lord be with you. I know many have not seen my face and videos for the past few weeks. But you have been receiving the messages of God. And this is a new year. The Lord spoke to me this 2015. It's the year of Joseph's favor and the Moses anointing. That means that God is going to use 2015 to mark the end time. So we must be prepared. I don't have much to say about it, but we must be prepared and separate ourselves. The message I want to start this 2015 it's quite very powerful, strong, and mighty. God is repeating the Bible. There is a nation in Africa, West Africa, where I'm telling you it's a prophecy which is going to come to pass very soon. Very, very soon. Once again, there's a nation in West Africa. It is called Cameroon. It's a French and English speaking country. That's actually my country. That's where I was born. And God spoke to me last year about this nation. There will be an exchange of government. God is going to repeat the days of Joseph, Daniel, and David. Had Joseph left prison, became the prime minister of Egypt. And Daniel left the lion's den, became the governor in Babylon. And David, from a shepherd boy to a king. God is concerned about nations. There will be an impactful year. Great, extreme, supernatural, and extraordinary miracle signs and wonders like never seen. Habakkuk chapter 1 verse 5 says, Watch and look at the nation and be utterly amazed. God said, I will do something in your time. Even they tell you, you won't believe. First Corinthians chapter 2, verse 9 says, No eye has seen, no ear has heard, no has it got the heart of men what God has planned for those who love him. I know you have watched your television, a lot of chaos, a lot of problems are happening, but let me tell you the truth. This year, a door is we are living in the end time. God is going to bring more, a lot of power. A supernatural wave of the spirit will fall in this generation and the voices will speak one more time. Before the children of Israel left Egypt, God did many kind of miracles just to show himself. That will happen the same. Before Jesus come, before we go to heaven, God will do mighty and great things. The devil is in trouble because God is using the young generation. Once again, there is a nation in Africa, the continent of Africa, the West Africa, Cameroon, which is my nation, my country. There will be an exchange of government where that country only have two presidents in the whole of history. I see the present president, President Paul Bia, handing power to a young man. God is going to repeat the days of Joseph in that country. And God is going to use that man in a very mighty and powerful way like Joseph, Daniel, and David with great power as a vessel to unite the churches, to unite men and women of God. Matthew 24 verse 14 says, And this gospel about the kingdom of God will preach to everyone in all the world as a testimony the end will come. That is the prophecy that we are living in 2015 till Jesus come. Great miracles, signs and wonders. This man that God is going to use, this young man. Nations will come after him. He will release the power from heaven. He will speak and power will come down. God has raised many other young women and men around the world in this end time to do mighty and great things. The old generation and the new generation will join together. You will see miracles like never seen before in 2015. We're not talking about next year. This now. I repeat again. The nation Cameroon. 
There will be an exchange of hands. You know, the Bible, there was a man in the book of Daniel, a king Belshazzar, writings at the wall. When Daniel interpreted it, he told him that God is going to take your kingdom away and give it to Darius. There's going to be an exchange of government. God is going to win nations. This man that God will use will be a very powerful man like David. Young man, the nation Cameroon. An exchange of government this year. And it's going to happen soon. God told me to release this prophecy to the public so that you may know when it comes to past weeks, you watch this video. Say, this prophet prophesied that the nation of Africa, West Africa, Cameroon, there will be an exchange of government. The kingdom of heaven. That nation will be used as an example all around other nations. And that's how God will walk through the presidents, the kings, the queens, the princes, the popular figures. There will be a lot of unity, a lot of power, a lot of miracles, signs, and wonders. I repeat again. I see a young man being a president of the nation Cameroon. And God will do a mighty work to him. And that's the message I have to give you. So be prepared in this 2015. Just thank God. Psalms 15 verse 22 says, Give it thanks to God and sacrifice. Spend your time thanking God, worshiping, praising Him. Enough acts of things. Just praise Him. Seek Him first the kingdom of God and righteousness, and everything will be added to you. That's what the Bible says. Now everything will be added. Prosperity like never seen before. Riches like never seen before. You don't have to pray for those things to come. God is going to release it, and it's already open in the heaven. So 2015 is a year of Joseph's favor and the Moses anointing. Shalom.